Hello, boys and girls. Welcome back to my channel. My name is B. I travel full time in my SUV chariot, and I also have a tiny trailer named Cadence. Welcome back to my channel. We are still in Venice. We are still in LA. We were supposed to leave two days ago. I like it. <laughs> I like it here. It's like I was driving through and I was like, this is a city of dreams from nightmares to like your highest highs. Like this is a city of dreams, bro. It's really, really like magical up in here. But I'm going to tell y'all something that happened last night. <sighs> okay. Last night I parked like in this really nice area. It was super nice. But then I kept on hearing this man. He was walking up and down the like picture a really tall white man with long penny blonde hair and then like a leather coat and he was like walking up and down the street and he was just like oh just walking 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 and making that noise right and i was like the fudge and then like a fire alarm went and they were on the same sound it was weird and so he just kept on walking ah! and he was walking like up and down and through the blocks and then then i heard like when he was walking past it was like it sounded like you know those like scaled creatures that like come out the water like this does that make sense i don't know it was just like And I was like, um, that's a living being and it's not a human being. And I was at the canals. And so I was like, bro, what is going on in the city of dreams? Because that sounded like an alien. That sounded like a alien. That's the only thing I can tell you. This just sounded like an alien, bro. So I was a little shook. So I moved somewhere else. I moved over to the fancy side of town um but yeah that was a very adventurous little moment in time i was like bro what's this i've never heard that before never 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 in my never 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 in my life have i ever heard the sound that i heard that, that man was singing and then basically when he started singing and walking past and then that noise happened it's like he was here and then the noise was down the block and he quickly uh, turned around the other way and started walking the other way so maybe they have like something going on and they know each other but um this time around okay the first time i went to la uh well not ever but the first time i went to la as a nomad was last winter and i was all like "Ooh, it's so nice it's so pretty the uh, most thing that made me nervous was finding good places to park because i kept on trying to park in the city like in 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 the city um which i don't understand why because there's a whole bunch of residential areas in la but i decided to be like i'm going right into the center of it that's a good place to park at night so i'm gonna go to a cafe today I really want to check out this other cafe. It's called the Reparations Club. It's a new black queer owned bookstore here in LA and I really have to try it out. So I'm probably not going to go to it today though because I need to do some work for a while and I don't know if they have a working like a co-working space but I'm definitely going to hit them up tomorrow and go in there and see some books and get some coffee and stuff. So yeah, the trip has been awesome. It's been really fulfilling. It's been super peaceful. It's been pretty warm compared to my other homes, uh, my other home locations. This is the warmest one right now. And so I'm just really happy to be here. I've gotten to see friends. I've gotten to be out in nature. And today I'm gonna be spending time at the beach, uh, working on some, my songs a little bit, and hopefully I'll be able to go and find some place to perform this evening. So that's the plan for today. So just letting y'all know a little bit of how the trip is going so far. So far, so good. And I'll probably at the end of this show y'all some videos of what it's looking like in downtown LA today. So thank y'all for tuning in and for giving me a moment of your time. And I will see y'all tomorrow when we head back to Arizona. Apparently it snowed there 
and it's been raining and so now we really get to test the waterproofing on the trailer i've been thinking about that like two times while i've been here i've been like man is it wet in there but then i'm like tapping into it i'm like it's good it's good it's okay but <sighs> yeah living in a wood box is uh different than living in a plastic box <laughs> you really have to worry about the water and uh like nature weathering your home so we'll see what it's looking like but i love the new setup that i've been doing in here this whole new setup i don't even know if i showed y'all let me see if i can show y'all I don't know if you can see it. It kind of looks messy, but it's not. It's just like my blankets are all wild right now. But over here, I got new. So it used to be three of those bins, right? Now I got two of these bins. They're hard top bins and they're collapsible. So now I have like hard storage and then I just have one of those woven bins. And it's been giving me so much more room. Like the woven bins are 13. Sorry, my my look at this necklace these are uh mustard seeds bruh have faith of a mustard seed and see what happens to your life anyway bro just chill bro here come back here so yeah um that storage back there the woven bins were 13 inches deep and these are 10 inches so i get three inches of bed space added to my area and i'm just like sleeping like a baby so it's been really good last night i ran out of food so i ate oatmeal but then i was like nah like i'm still hungry so i went to sweet green so those are the random thoughts of a traveler on a wednesday afternoon So let's show y'all the city, okay? I just finished up doing all my work for the day and now I'm on Abbott Kenny Boulevard which doesn't make a difference to me what boulevard I'm on but uh it's cute it's cute but I don't feel like spending any money so you know what we're doing we're doing what we we're gonna do earlier we're going to the beach so I'm about to go hop into my truck. I've been here more than two hours, so let's see if I got a ticket or not. Crossing my fingers, I didn't. So let's go and check it out. And then we'll go over to the beach. I forgot to tell y'all what else happened. I was sitting over here and I had my covers on. I was watching a show and then I got hit. So somebody backed into my the side of my car today. So the chariot never gets a break, okay? so yeah i got hit today and um luckily she was dope her dad came out and called the insurance and all that stuff so that's good but yeah so now my front door has a big old dent in it so hopefully they'll be able to fix it when i get back to nashville we shall see hopefully they don't have to take my car for too long that's my main thing but yeah so that was a fun thing that happened today but anyways to the beach <laughs>
we made it out here again. I love the sun. I feel like a child. I feel like a baby just on a ride right now. Just chilling, super happy. It feels super good. The sand here is super, super soft. Like softer than any other sand I've felt before. Like it's super thin and cozy, but. So I'm gonna do some writing out here. I got a good little spot. I got my little, you can't even hardly see it, but I got my big, uh, big little uh, towel and I got my goodies in here. So I'm gonna start doing some writing and kind of touching up a couple songs I'm working on and just kind of watch the sunset before I have my last meeting for the day. But I'll show y'all what the water's looking like and then we're gonna cut it out for the rest of the day. Tomorrow's my last day here for real this time. I'm leaving tomorrow night and headed back towards Arizona. So this is the last sunset I'm gonna see here till next time I come back out. So I'm gonna enjoy it have a good time looking at the water so thank y'all so much for tuning in and watching my shenanigans as i travel and fumble around la it's been a really fun time this time i know as i keep on coming back it's gonna get better and better so i'm really excited to see what happens next time and like when i just got here to the beach like as soon as i walked on to the uh boardwalk some people i knew came by and they're like hugging me it's like hey like, hey yay. so it's crazy like it's a small freaking world out here so get outside Anyways, thank you. I appreciate you and I'll see you on the next video.